द मोमेंट यू टेक लिटल बिट मोर देन योर कैपेसिटी यू विल सफर सफरिंग बिगिन्स वन मिलीग्राम बियॉन्ड योर your limit beyond your capacity you cannot take in no matter how much ever you work hard it will not stay with you see this uh, this problem is coming it's a modern day problem it, in india it didn't exist at least 100 years back that we all have got some foreign ideas in our mind what is that foreign idea this uh, foreign idea videshi idea is that we believe that i am qualified i can desire anything we don't think that we need qualification to desire we assume that i can i can enjoy anything in this world that's why we develop desire beyond our capacity the basic idea in our indian culture is that you first realize what is your capacity because the laws of nature it's a law of nature it is arranged in such a way whatever is your capacity will be given to you you don't have to do anything for that it's a fact whatever is our capacity is arranged for us whatever is not in your capacity no matter how much ever you work hard it will not stay with you is all part of law of karma having is not equal to enjoying today modern day people have some wrong idea in their mind they think having is equal to enjoying or oh, i will have it go on having 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 means accumulating so much they think they think that if i have more i think i've enjoyed more it's totally wrong with common sense we can understand how wrong it is like we all like gulab jamun or rasgulla something like that okay i'll give you one gulab jamun you can have it you will enjoy it very nice i'll give one more oh very nice so nice prabhu ji so you'll eat that also i'll give one more very nice you'll eat that also okay up to some 3 4 5 or let's say up to 10 also you'll enjoy let's say i'm giving you the 60th gulab jamun now what will happen to you kya hoga aapko ha same gulab jamun which you thought enjoyment for you will become now pain nahi chahiye mujhe nahi chahiye wapas le nahi prabhu nahi chahiye no, why kyun nahi chahiye hey, enjoyment hai na le lo aur le lo beyond your capacity you cannot take please understand this we all have our capacity if you take your body has a mechanism to flush it out it cannot it cannot consume it oh it is good for my body let me eat more can you take more just because it is good for your health you cannot take anything in this world beyond your capacity this is what isha upanishad says isha vasyam idam sarvam it said everybody in this world they can only take as per their capacity if they take more than that the same thing will become punishment for them this is common sense we all have to understand this this common sense is missing in the modern day civilization they think they are very smart they think i am no what is that limitation for me i can i can keep whatever i want i can take whatever i want you cannot take that's why our desire should be educated desire we cannot have uneducated desire what is this uneducated desire i will eat 100 gulab jamun it is an uneducated desire yeah that is a desire but it is uneducated desire why it is called uneducated desire because you are missing some common sense there what is that common sense it is beyond the capacity of my enjoyment that means i should develop desire as per my capacity not uh, beyond my capacity so today people think like this oh i should get 1 crore rupees package 
I should earn 100 crore. And also some people encourage, sky is the limit. It's total nonsense it is. What is sky is the limit means what? For everybody sky is the limit, is it? Sky is the limit. No, eat some 200 gulab jamun. <laughs> you tell sky is the limit. Your next day your stomach will tell what is the limitation. <laughs> these, these are all modern day uneducated motivation. Good motivation hai. Like an uneducated motivation. <laughs> you understand? Sky is the limit, it seems. So, kuch bhi karo. Anne, you know, sky is the limit. It's Ishopanishad says, our limitation, everybody's limitations are different. We have to realize it. That is called education. Education is to know what is my limitation. So that I can happily live. The moment you take little bit more than your capacity, you will suffer. Suffering begins one milligram beyond your, your limitation. Otherwise, what is suffering? Gulab Jamun is supposed to be always giving us enjoyment. No. It will not give you enjoyment always. It will give enjoyment within your capacity. The same Gulab Jamun will give you problem the moment it is beyond your capacity. In this world, everything is like that. Isn't it? Now you see in the, you know, in the winter season, it's so cold. Ah, room heater is there, so nice like that. So you put fire on your body. A heat chai, a heat chai. No, according to your capacity, that much heat you can take. You can't take more heat on your body. So everything should be as per what is our limit. So, Yadrucha Lava Santushtaha means according to my capacity in the nature it has been arranged. I should only put that much effort to get what is my capacity. But today, what do the people think? They have become so greedy. They, they say, work hard, work hard, work hard. Okay, what can happen is you can, you can get, you can accumulate but you will not be allowed to enjoy. You can accumulate, you can keep it with you, but you cannot enjoy. Like simple example, you can send gulab jamun inside. Hey, oh, achcha hai, achcha, achcha enjoyment hai. Like this, it will go inside, but your body will not take it. It will throw it outside again. Likewise, if you take more money in your life, more than your capacity, the excess money will not stay with you. In the Shastra it is said, it will go out. How? You will get diseases. Because of which, you have to pay all that extra money which you have accumulated. For, for that extra money to go away from you, you get some diseases where you have to spend a lot of money in the hospital. Like nowadays, you see so many diseases, so many hospitals. When I was small, if I go to doctor, you know, doctor will say, take care, you know, they'll say, uh, if I say, see you doctor next, no, 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 I mean, up either. That was the mood and mentality of the doctor. Now the, the hospital say, next time when will you come? Or in fact, the, the way they treat itself is so that we next time we'll land up there. <laughs> so the point here is, you cannot take more. If you take more, the law of nature is arranged. Like for example, taxation. How the government has planned the tax. They say up to one level, there is one slab, no tax. 3 lakh or 5 lakh. Nobody has to pay any tax. That is your limitation. You can enjoy. No need to pay any tax. Okay, little more than that, pay 30% tax. More than that, the tax start increasing. Government wants to take more from you. The moment you start accumulating more, they want to take more out of you. Right? So laws of nature also like that. They want to take anything which is more than your capacity. Because it's not good for you. Not that uh, laws of nature are your enemy. They're your friend. They want to help you. Because if you are unnecessarily keeping more with you, it causes problem for you. So laws of nature figures out ways and means to take out. Like, you get so many diseases. This is first symptom. 
diseases so many diseases come because to take away all your excess money that you have accumulated and then it is said there will be so many legal cases where you have to go and waste all your money unnecessarily it is not required that extra money has to go out like this there will be disease it is said in shastra chronic disease legal disputes all these things in this way what is more than our capacity will be taken away so people can think oh i am earning so much it is so much is with me you will see the children will be born in such family just to make sure all the excess money will be destroyed <laughs> no the shastra is saying like this because you are not allowed to take more than your capacity this is the law of nature you cannot be more smarter than the law of nature you ought oh i'm so intelligent i will get more and keep it with me in olden the indians thinking our culture our country is such that nobody will do all such things everyone knows what is required for me that much only i'll keep it even if you give them they will not accept they say not required no not not required it is called anartha in sanskrit anartha means unwanted each one of you know up to what number gulab jamun is not anartha after what number same gulab jamun will become anartha anartha means unwanted it is no more wanted now if you forcefully send it will create problem for you so yadrichha labha santushtah means with my minimum efforts whatever comes in my life that is meant for my happy and peaceful life anything more than that in the name of hard work hard work hard work i accumulate it has to go out in all this manner with common sense intelligence we can watch all these things we don't need any extraordinary explanation for all this this is what isho panishad explains and each one of our capacity is different it's not same like for example i can eat one gulab some of you may eat two somebody may eat five and up for them it is good they don't fall sick by eating five but if i eat five i will fall sick so we should know what is our capacity you understood so please don't believe more money more property more this means more enjoyment there is nothing called more money more enjoyment what is your capacity that is your enjoyment more money more gulab jamun is never equal to more enjoyment i hope you all understand that right likewise more money is never equal to more enjoyment don't believe in all these things